What's going on? Back plugged in again. What's your boy, the Prophet? Hey, yo, man. So I know we just did a video for you guys, but we had some more information and some more news. And I wanted to go ahead and get this video out, and I didn't want to slow down the upload of my last video. So just going to talk about some things really quickly. Um, we do have some new resurrection news, and I kind of went over that, but now at least I get to kind of like see the images. So let's see here. Eisen, just keep doing your thing. Uh, let's see. All right. So the new Baragon, I, I'm kind of disappointed in these resurrection characters because... Baragon got last ditch 80%, which that's a good link, but he didn't get Havoc. A lot of people were wanting this Baragon to have Havoc because he has a really good kit. He didn't get Havoc. He did get, um, he did get Berserker 20, so that's pretty good. Zio, DR, he's still mid. He's still, um, a hybrid unit. And then Wonder White Scott, weakened defense. It's, with the fire duration, he's still once again a hybrid. This this banner has two hybrids in it. So, uh, this resurrection batch has two hybrids. We're going to have one point event, uh, extra stage or whatever. So, that's that. All right. So, these are the characters in the banner. Um, these we went over for this for this particular banner, but we have a bunch of tickets that we have the news for now, and we also have a a free banner. So, um, let's see here. So this is the filler for the burn the witch banner. Um, and to be honest, like Bruno is really good. I I really have to test him. This is gonna be a good example. Because I can test him versus my one of five little borrow speed test. I can test him head to head straight up, and I can see if Bruno can compete with little borrow with having better stats and skills, but a worse for a strong attack. So, and he does have a range collision first. It is the best type of range collision in my personal opinion. The forty magnification attack, and it has like a maximum of like eight hits or something. So you can get almost sixty percent additional damage of a standard first strong attack, but your damage isn't always going to be so consistent. So keep that in mind. He does have, you know, the best second strong attack standardly, not including the double vortex second strong attack. And, um, you know, he has a full screen third, double killer, absolutely incredible character. I'm going to go at least 10 steps on the banner. And I'm going to personally hope that I can get him three or five, at least two or five, maybe by step 10. And then maybe I think about five more steps. My Noel is max transcended with level three SP. So I'm praying I don't see many dupes of her. I actually need four Nini dupes to get her max transcended. Which, like, if it happens, I'll be great. This Veruca is new, and Kukaku is new for me as well. Half her four or five, half her two or five, four or five, five or five. So, yeah, that's that banner. We kind of went over this. Now, this is new, though. This um, free brave summons mix uh, 10, you know, one free multi a day. Sub 10 guarantees one five star. So these will be so all characters added to the premium pool between um, 8 16 2019 and July 23rd of 20. So all seasonal characters released from basically the same day. So Fogetsu and Fit and Ibiaki are in this banner. So once again, I need three more Fogetsu for mine to be max transcended. My Biaki's ID max transcended. Um, and there's a couple premium characters that I still would like to get a couple dupes of. So this will be happening. Uh, when does this happen? October 11th. So this will be happening the same exact day as the Bruno banner, which that's pretty good news. Brave Souls pack. This will be a um, uh, 144 orb ticket. So it'll be the standard pack. Uh, it'll be the standard price of a pack like 23 or 24 dollars usd 
this pretty much new premium UDU SS Nimu. This red two is very good. So these first three units in this pack are solid. I want to say Udu solid because he's a new premium. Probably won't have him. But yeah, these other characters are pretty mid. Uh, Ginray is really good for range. Hollow Week and Guild Quest. And he already is pretty solid as well. The Soy Phone doesn't really have offer much utility at all. And you have the Brave Soul Silver pack. This one is about the uh, $49 pack, I believe. What? These, this is garbage. How is the $20 pack so much better than the $40 pack? This is shit. Like, this is like a 2018 character. 2018, 2018. These are old as shit. That's garbage. Why would you buy that? Why would you buy that? This Nelia is solid. And she's new, premium. Rinji's, he's so derpy, but he's a solid flurry character. You have Apache. Who's pretty solid. Who's pretty solid for a spot a week guild quest if you don't have Mama Rukia or can't fear and wear a Gein, or not Gein, excuse me, Mayuri. This Toshi is pretty solid as well. This Ichigo kind of cheeks. This Aizen is pretty solid. Kind of kind of mid, but he's okay though. Rukia is still good. Still solid, garbage, and pretty bad now. Um, that's the 50 out. That's the like 585 worth pack. So that's kind of weird. Burn the witch point event. So you get an, so you get the new Osushi familiar from the point event. There is no special move source. So all right, and here's the new beginner ticket. And this is one of the better buys. So. Spirit Society, Rangiku, Mandi Sane, First Battle, Ichigo, uh, Machine Society, Retsu, Sumsu Orihime. She's a Chronicle Quest character. That's very important for some of you guys. That's a that's a chron This ticket is gonna be like three dollars. Three ninety-nine. I'll actually probably do a giveaway. I'll probably give away a um probably like five of these packs for people. So I'll do that on my channel. We'll we'll work out how we do it uh, in the live stream. But make sure you guys are there when I do my summons for this. If you guys are like totally free to play and maybe you want this beginner's ticket, um, definitely a solid, solid pick. Now, I don't remember. I think it's a choose ticket. I think the beginner ticket is a choose, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure it is because it's always a very very good value I'm almost positive it's a choose ticket so that's pretty much the last thing that we got they did tell us a few days ago that we're gonna get a new beginners ticket but you know now we know the filler pool yeah Ginzuru, um, Parasol Halibel, Heart Ishin, Stinky Winky, Halloween Gein, I don't have him I don't have the Halloween Gein, Kimpachi, SS Biot, wow he's still got tier yeah, past Kisuke, Christmas, Nelio, and um, Machine Oak. Pretty solid. Pretty good stuff, you guys. Pretty good stuff. This is definitely a pretty good beginner's ticket. Like I said, make sure you guys join the live stream if you want to be entered in a giveaway to maybe win one of these, you know, beginner's tickets. Because I will be giving away a few of those. Something pretty simple to do for the community, especially to my people that are just 100% free to play. But yeah, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe to the next time. Proper nature. I do love y'all. I'm out.